how to add reviews to Wix website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can add a review to your website within Wix. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning to the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to go to Wix.com. Then simply create an account within it. If you have an account, you are going to see here we have been signed in. Now, if you have a website ready, you are going to customize this website. If you don't have a website, create a new website. Now, I have here my website ready and waiting for the editing. I will click on select and edit site. Simply, it will open up the Wix dashboard first. Within this dashboard, you can go ahead and set, set all the options from the payment uh, methods, from the products, if you have an e-commerce store, and also for the events and booking. Now, let's go ahead right to the edit site. The website is now loaded. And as you can see, we have created a website full of products. This is a e-commerce website. I have here the left sidebar menu. You can go ahead and add some elements from it. To add the review bar or the review section, all you have to do is to click on add elements. Now we have the option right here you can go ahead and search for a certain option or certain review bar. Click on search. Simply we are going to put or write review. Review right here. And I will type search. You can add to your site a testimonials stripe. Or you can add a apps or certain apps from the Wix app store. As you can see we have Kudo Buzz reviews, Ferrer views, or customer reviews. Now let's go and begin with adding the testimonials here strip. Here we have the type of testimonial strips. As you can see here, we have these. We have this with the widgets or the face of the interviewers. We have here a simple interview face right there. You can go ahead and add this one or whatever. I'm going to choose this one, for example. It will be added as a different section since it is a strip. Now we have the customization of that. Here we have the title of what people say. I can go ahead and edit that text. You can go ahead and edit the font of the text. You can put the styling, the font size, the uh, alignment, and you can add some effects to the text. As you can see, you can add some shadows. You can make it bold like that and etc. For these cases, we have a lot of uh, columns. Here we have three columns. You can add columns or you can go ahead and pick up a column. Then we can modify it. You can change the background. As you can see, we have here a transparent background. You can add a video uh, above the, uh, the uh, here testimonial or you can add a image or let it as a color like that. You can modify the text right here. You can put the name of the interviewer. For example, I'm going to put here Jack. Uh, this is the name of the interviewer. I'm going to put here 28 year old like that. Here I am. I'm going to put Smith. Let's put Smith. 35 year old like that. Or you can put the a name of the person and then you are going to put his career or his profile for example software engineer and here we have it and you can go ahead and modify this and put it as a quote that was for this uh, first method when you finish here the testimonials you can go ahead and click on save you can preview it and uh, finally can publish it to the website now Let's go to another method. If you don't like this type of testimonials or review bar or section, simply go to ElfSite. ElfSite is a interface that will help you create some widgets without coding. And the final step is to give you that code and you are going to insert it to your website. Go to ElfSite.com, then we are going to visit the widgets. We have here tons of widgets that we can be created within Elfsight. 
And from those uh, widgets, we have the reviews. We have Airbnb reviews, all-in-one reviews, Amazon reviews, and the most important one is Google reviews. We have also a testimonial slider. I'm going with the Google reviews. Here, it will give you the option to customize or fully customize the uh, widget. I'm going to view my widget. I have already created a widget. Simply, I'm going to edit it. And here, uh, as you can see, this is the widget from scratch. We have the source, the business name and address. You can go ahead and put the location of your business. We can search and it will load up automatically the reviews directly from Google. Here we have the layout. You can see here we have multiple layout, grid, carousel, list, masonry, badge, or a slider. Let's go with the carousel. Here we have the content width. You can go ahead and customize whatever you want from the layout. We have widget title, header, and etc. Click on review. Here it will let you see the review style. We have multiple styles. We have this one, we have three until now, and we have the review source style. You can go ahead and change it like that. Put the names and the photos of these persons. Now let's proceed to the styles. We have here the color scheme, the accent color. You can go ahead and put the accent, uh, change the color of them like that. Or you can pick up any color that you want like this. And here we have the customization of the elements. We have the background, widget title, header, rating, reviews, and etc. Now, for the settings, we have here the language of the reviews. You can see here that we can fully customize these. You can auto translate the reviews, but this is an upgradable option. And you can also manipulate those reviews directly. As you can see here, I'm going to click on customize and you can make these as much as you want. You can show the reviewer name, reviewer picture, and etc. Let's go back right here and publish. We are going to publish it, close that window, and here we have the uh, review from Google. If you want to add this to your website, click simply on install, and here we have an embed code right here. We are going simply to copy that code and go to Wix. When you go to Wix, you are simply going to add an element. I am going, not uh, element, but I'm going to add a section. Let's go ahead with a blank section. Here we have the blank section. Simply click on add element again, go to embed code, HTML or embed HTML, add to site. It will show up a little box having the uh, settings. Add your code here. HTTPS only. Make sure to check up the code. And here we are going to put or paste the code from Elfsight. Click on update and I will give it a few seconds to load up and here we have it. Here we have the custom review widget from Google. Like this and here we have it. You can go ahead and make this like that or hide it. Here we have the reviews and everything is going well. When you finish, simply click on save preview and finally publish. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.